What is going on, Raj? Coming at you, I know it's been a minute. It's been a minute. I've been going through it, but it's okay. I've been keeping the faith. I've been holding on and just trying to keep it moving. And uh, I miss you guys. So now I'm coming back. You know, I haven't really been posting on Facebook. You know, I just haven't been posting on Facebook. Just little stuff me in there. I had two days off, so I put up what I was wearing. But, you know, I, this this is the season. I'm really not feeling it this year. And, uh, you know, this is one of the things that happen from time to time. It's kind of rare for me, but it's okay. We're going to keep it pushing. And once again, as long as the Almighty got me, that, that's the main thing. And I hope he's taking care of you and your family as well and getting you ready for this season. And uh, remember the reason for the season, but don't let this be just the reason for the season about gifts and all that stuff, but let it be always, always, you know what I mean? It's never a day that it's not the day. All right, so let's go ahead on and uh, talk about some smell goods. But before we do that, we're going to touch on a few new things. Of course, y'all know I got I grabbed the um, the Ventura. I'm, I'm really, I'm really like, I don't wear it two days in a row. I really like wearing this. I still got the plastic on it, but uh, I really like wearing my Ventura. So this is a, um, this is Ventura XXL by Hamilton. It's an automatic, nothing fancy except for what's going on with it. Y'all know I like to break, just groundbreaking stuff. I like to wear stuff that nobody else is wearing. So I grabbed one of these real quick. All right, the price list is 1342, 1345 plus tax. I mean, stay out of my pockets. You stay out of my pockets. But nevertheless, um, yeah, it's just it's kind of a high-end product. It's not as high, not as high as the other one I got, the X Chrono that I got last year. But basically, I wait for the Macy's uh, friends and family to get twenty-five percent off. So it only came to ten, uh, ten eighty with tax. So it's pretty cool. All right, the one last year I think it was fifteen. I got that for like eleven, something like that. You know what I mean? So yeah, and I got the club plan, so you got to pay it off in twelve months be done. I try to get done before then, but you know, never know. So, let's see what's up. So, hope y'all digging that. That's called the Hamilton Ventura XXL. Probably like a, a, a Elvis Presley joint. I don't like Elvis. Refer to Public Enemy for that for me. And But I do like the watch. I right, holler. I got it against Hamilton. Yeah, he was doing what he did. Alright, so, I had been thinking about what was the last fragrances I'm going to get for the year. Cause this is the last. Now let something come up. On a real, real cheap. I mean, other than that, uh, this is gonna be it for me. And uh, the one I was really looking at was uh, made by uh, uh, Baptiste de France. Let, let me look it up. I was really racking my brain over there and checking speaks, checking speaks um, um, Spanish cedar. I was thinking about that, but you know what? I am not getting neither one of those because I have been checking this one out. And I didn't want to spend a lot of money for, for, for the holidays, so I decided to cut down. Instead of getting a 100 mil, I just got a 50 mil. Because I had so much stuff. So, why well, have so much juice? I'm going to say stuff. I have so much juice. I don't even get 100 mil, or not unless it's a great deal. And it makes sense to get 100 mil as opposed to getting 50. Because there's like a $30 difference or a $40 difference. Maybe. But if there's an $80 difference like Tom Ford tried to do, I get out of here. You know what I'm saying? It got to be special. Like the old Amber Absolute. All right, what I was looking at was a uh, or uh, but Bastide. Okay, that's all I was looking for. Uh, I was looking to get was one of was uh, uh Parfums de la Bastide. There's a new French company that just came out. It actually came out in 2014, but they really started to get their stuff out there. And I was really looking at Ardent. And uh, man, woody, fresh, spicy, warm, spicy, aromatic, powdery, balsamic. I really, it really was like that's something I really want to look at. And only because of the notes. Cardamom, nutmeg, cypress, cumin. Um, um, what else is in here? Cumin, cedar, cashmere wood, and sandalwood. That might be something I might hopefully get in the beginning of the year, because I really, those notes. This nutmeg thing is really starting to like really get at me, right? Cause I can't wait. I got somebody, I'm trying to pick up this uh, nutmeg and ginger by Joe Malone. I wouldn't smell it. It doesn't last long, but it's some nutmeg. Nutmeg is like, whoa. This nutmeg is like crazy. By the way, we listen to all the CDs from songs that may be on my next CD, just the instrumentals. I figured I'd play those in the background. 
But yeah, yeah, that's not bad. Just, I'm like, man, I don't want that. So this girl was selling on uh, on on one of the uh, sell sites. I'm like, I don't want that. But I mean, she only wanted like a couple of dollars for it. I said, well, I'll go get it. Still waiting to pick it up. And then, so I went to uh, Joe Malone today. Actually, I went in the other day. And I said, like, this is not bad. And Nutmeg, there's also Nutmeg and this other fragrance called Clockwork by Rose that I like the Nutmeg in. So Nutmeg and Ardent Perfumes, I know it's going to smell good, especially especially the way it's like they got mixed with cedar too. Man, but the Ginger Bray and the Nutmeg and Joe Malone's Nutmeg and Ginger, man, y'all better check that out. That's, that's not a sleeper, man. I think that's for men and women too. Let me take a look at that. Yeah, women and men, man. That, that's a nice piece. Don't let nutmeg and ginger throw you off. They could have named that like Roger Zoot Juice, but nutmeg and ginger, that thing is popping. That thing don't last long. That's okay, wear it to work. That way you know you can wear something in the evening. Or you can change up. You can wear it in the evening if you wore something during the day. As long as the one you ain't wear during the day lasts like 500 hours. But if you wanna wear that in the morning, it'll be done in about four or five hours. Then you can spray up again for your evening. So respray or put on something else for the evening. You know, whatever you got to do, all right? So basically, I'm waiting for that. Royal Oud. I smelled Royal Oud when it first came out. I'm like, yeah, that's pretty nice. I just didn't like the price point. So I'm in there tonight. I'm trying to pick up what I got to pick up. They ain't had a one that I wanted. I'll show you all that. But they did have the other one finally. First, they ain't have it. I think I rolled all the way out here and you don't have it. They finally dug it up and got me one. But she said, well, if you smell Royal Oud, I'm like, yeah. I said, because I'm in the Oud. She's like, well, smell it. I said, I already smelled it. I said, it's okay. She's like, smell it again. So I said, all right, put it right there. Because you know, I sprayed up with that Santal 33 today by Le Labo. Holla, your boy 100, Sandalwood, Marlboro, man. Get at you. Everybody loving it. So, man, th this is good. Royal is Royal Oud is good by Creed. I'm telling you, Royal Oud, I mean, I got to investigate what the longevity is on because you know they want like $345,000. Oh no, there's two. Fragodex got it for $198 for $2.5, but it's not bad. It's not the best. Well, you know how I feel about Creed. But somebody said it smells like Intense Black by Lamani. Lomani. Intense Black. 29 people say it smells like Intense Black. Follow Monty. Woody, balsamic, ooh, fresh, spicy, and green. And how much does Lomani cost on Amazon? Lomani will cost you $37. As opposed to $37. Now so for grant, I'm just I'm just telling you. On for Granica, 29 people says that Royal Oud smells like now y'all know how you got the, some of them smell like this, smell like that, you know what I mean? Like Santal, the Santal, or Imperial Santal, whatever it is. They had that one individual that smelled like it. You know, sometimes you got that. And if it smells close enough, it does make sense just to buy the cheaper one. Because, I don't care how long it lasts, I'll just re-up. But, I don't know. They got, it's over 204 some places. Different is perfume and Lomani is a, 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 a cologne or a toilet, of course. Oh, uh, but it is good. It is good. It really is good. I told her I smell cedar wood. That's not really cedar more wood, but man, it's citrus. Even though I got the cedar wood and the sandalwood in there, which I like, of course. It smells good. So I'm gonna give Royal Oud. I'm gonna give Creed his due on that. I ain't gonna even front on the Venice. I mean, Venice is good. I just think Oud and Mortel isn't as sweet, and I think it's more dense than than the big pineapple that you get from from a, a Venice. I'd rather go with, with the uh, Oude Mortel by Byredo. You know, I ain't gonna sweat on that. And, you know, the vetiver uh, geranium is nice too. That's a nice piece. I even like Virgin Island water, but it only lasts like five minutes. I'm just saying. I do like some Creed's. Don't act like I'm just a Creed hater. I do like some Creed's. All right, boom, bam. We did that. We got the nutmeg, we got the royalty. Let's talk about what I picked up tonight. Started Neiman Marcus. Oh, by the way, they gave me uh, some satin mood. If you buy the one that's uh, $195, you get like seven of them in there or something like that, they'll give you a satin nude. they give you a 10 mil satin nude, but 
That's all right. Just, get, just keep going up there and say, you got a sample? You got a sample? You got a sample? You got a sample? And you'll have 10 mil of sad news. Sad news the bomb. It's Uber Vanilla. Pretty much. It's all of his ooze, but this one has vanilla instead. It's nice though. Okay. What else did they give me for samples? Rose Bar Bear. I always ask for Rose Bar Bear. That is off Armani Pre's Rose Bar Bear, which is very nice rose. Receipts. Another sample. Oh, she she sprayed me out uh what did she spray me out? Let's see. I know she sprayed. Damn, what did she spray me out? This is something she was like right here. She sprayed me out something. I know, man, I forgot. But it smells like rose. Speaking of rose, I was just on a rose and I went to eat in the year with rose. You know what I mean? Rose. So I had this one on my mind. This one's been on my mind for like two months. Two months. What is it? Aaron, even Rose. Why you say? Why you say, Raj? Why do you need Aaron's even Rose? Why? Well, I wanted to get a Rose. I had a Rose in my mind. In fact, I chose these two over getting the Bastille. Um, the Bastille uh, uh, Arden. I chose these two over there. First of all, I get two for the price of the same price. Well, it's a little bit more. Exactly a little bit more. But still, I get two around that same price. Aaron is the company that came from Estee Lauder. It's Estee Lauder's granddaughter. She decided she wanted to make a fragrance. Yes. The price, 110. Beautiful box. And of course, that's the Lord has something to do with Tom Ford, so you know, that's a lineage. So that's the Lord don't always have to be considered like, you know, some old grandma sauce. This bottle, that shit has its own cage, but it's gone. What happened to it? it Bow in my hand. All right, why would I buy this rose? Why would I buy Aaron even a rose? Well, I went in there one day and I was smelling, I said, I just want to smell all the roses. So I was smelling Rose Barbare. Cause I, I ain't know, look, I didn't want to spend $300 for Rose Barbare. It's 290 plus tax. I, look, I went in on that dog on Ombra Centrico. I, I wasn't going in on Armani like that again. You know what I mean? I don't know why I can't get this in. Oh, cause the paper's in there. So I didn't want to go in on them. So I said, let me find something else. So I was asking around and I kind of happened by the uh, Aaron counter. And I saw the Aaron counter, I'm like, oh, even the rose. But first I heard about the amber. I said, let me try the amber first. So I smelled the amber and then the young lady came over there and was like, it's okay, but you would like this evening rose. I'm like, well, why do I want the evening rose? This is all her scents on a piece of paper. Okay, so you get inside. So I was like, why would I want even a rose? She said, because it's better than the amber. She said it has rum and incense. I was like, boozy incense and rum. Who doing that? Sprayed that on me, took some samples home, played with it, thought about it. Then you know, some other stuff came up as y'all well know. Other stuff came up. I done ruined this plastic, but I'm gonna get it back together. Other stuff came up. So Rose kept getting knocked back, knocked back, knocked back, knocked back. You know, I picked up the coach, got that at a real good price. Picked up the uh, the uh, uh, Alfred and Hoff. I was picking up a lot of stuff. So I'm like, man, it just kept getting pushed back because it's not really expensive, only $110 for a 50 mil. So I just get, kept getting pushed back though. And then finally last night I went out there and said, man, I, gotta, I just gotta get this. I gotta get this for the year end. And this one you get pure, pretty little. It don't, it's like it's like a, a, a one mil bottle, but it's really pretty big. 
beautiful little top. The top is plastic, but it's heavy. So really, I think this is plastic, but this right here, this nugget right here is pretty heavy. Wow, I thought it was all plastic. It's pretty heavy. Wow. Gold uh, spritzer. Uh, you got a little indentation here, so it's not just a flat. They put, they put a little work in there. Man, I like this song, man. I can't wait to do CD. So yeah, this is pretty nice. We nugget in there, you know. Man, incense, rose, and rum. The thing about it is, what makes this cool is you really don't smell a lot of rose when it starts to dry down. You smell a combination of all of the incense, the rum, and the incense, the rum, and the yami. This is the rum and and, and, and and the rose. Notes are as follows. Rose, balsamic, smoky, fruity, and warm, spicy. Okay? All right. Aaron Lauder, Estee Lauder's granddaughter, founded her lifestyle brand in 2011, has since become popular for her cosmetics, okay? So go past all that. We're gonna talk about even rose. It's a feminine day to night fragrance. Fragrant notes include, incorporate a juicy blackberry, rich cognac, combined with a voluptuous rose centifolia, a, a Bulgarian rose, absolute, and incense, okay? Perfume hides in a package hither pattern, which is adapted from the English Jacobson hand block linen from the Ligia 4 archive dating back to the 20th century. Whatever. The fragrance arrives on the market in 2013. I was gonna get 100 mil, but no, I don't need 100 mil of this. No. Because there's no way this should just be for women. They, they, got, they got roses that definitely say men and women. There's just no way this shouldn't be unisex. Again, just like Safari, just like uh, uh, Sahara in the Ore, just like Black Orchid. Come on, man. Men like wearing roses? Come on, dog. I'm wearing this to I'm, yo, I'm wearing, I know I'm, I'm wearing this to work tomorrow. Evening rose. Get you some of that. Get you some. You would not be disappointed. Incense, rum, the only thing, if they took out the rose, if they took out the rose, you would have a scent. Look, top notes, cognac and blackberry. Middle notes, rose and Bulgarian rose. Base note, incense. Take out the rose you have you have a uh, blackberry, rum, and incense. You almost have a uh, Jubilation 25 without all the extra stuff they got in there. Yo, this right here, this is truth. How long does it last? It doesn't last really long. It's like six hours. But for 110 bucks for for uh, the 50 mil, man, you can't you can't go wrong with this. Women can't go wrong with this either. You know, you may not be able to get past the incense. You can get past the rum. The incense might throw, throw women off a little bit. It's a little dark. But it's not a heavy dark incense. Man, this joint the bomb. Some people on for granted because not liking it. Very long lasting. A lot of people got very long lasting. And some people say they got it smells like velvet rose and ooh. So I checked out velvet rose and ooh. Two totally different juices. That was another one I compared the two before I got the rose. Cause I wanted the last one to be a rose, like I said. No way, man. No way, man. This, this right here, even a rose right here, this right here. That the air in here, right there. So, did that. Put that all in there. So then, while I was smelling the other roses, I said, well, look, I, I came across the Joe Malone. And I, I ran into this rose that they only making, like, once. And you know that's what they say. But this is not bad. This is not, this, you know, it's, Look, I, come on, man. I ain't just buying anything. Even on a deal, I'm not buying anything. Hey, look, I'm going to keep it real with y'all. That nutmeg and ginger, I'm getting that for $15. Man, that thing smells fantastic. And it's about, it's only, she got 100, I think it's 100 mil. She didn't use like maybe 10 mil out of that. 15 bucks? Man, I can't wait to scoop that up tomorrow, hopefully. Joe Malone.
The only other Joe Malone I have in my collection, which again I got off of a site, of a selling site, and I don't want to knock out all this time she did. She did a great job. I want to thank Joanne. I want to thank Joanne at um, filling in for Ellen Brett and um, and for uh, uh, Mary Beth. They weren't there tonight, so Joanne fills in. Actually, Joanne told me they ain't had no, no evening rolls. I'm like, I'm almost up here now. But she's able to dig one up for me. So thanks to Joanne at Neiman's. And I also want to thank Teresa at Bloomingdale's. Taking filling in for the Joe Malone people because there wasn't even Joe Malone people there tonight. So she filled in for them. So I'm gonna leave all this in there. I like the bag tied. I'm gonna pull out what we get ready to check out from Joe Malone. Put the bag back in there. Yeah, I know I've been called OCD tonight. That's what it is, yo. I mess the bag up. She did a great job tying that up. You know I mean, she said she tried to do the best she could. I'm like, look, it's just fine. I'm just glad I got in. Because I got there just in time. Dude was locking the doors on one side. I had to go through the men's side. You know, I went to Blooming, uh, Bloomingdale's and Willow Grove. I had to go through the men's side to get in. That's how fast I was trying to hurry up and get in that bad boy. I really wanted to have both of those tonight so I can do this for y'all tonight. So again, these are reviews. These are reviews because I, 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 I didn't investigate them for like two, three days. This more. This is almost like a month. So this, this no doubt is what it is, what they sell for Granica. I told you the price. I told you make it. Uh, let's see, Lord's granddaughter. Bam, bam, look at them bubbles all in there. Long lasting. You got them for Granica. You can't beat it. And I like it. I like it so much I got spray right there. I just can't, can't wait. Oh. Oh. Oh, man. We first spray a little alcohol but after that, you get a little oil residue. I'll tell y'all no more. Now, Joe Malone has come out with this exclusive piece for now. And I saw it, and I think I was recommending it. Well, you know, you should try this rolls out. You want to try this rolls out? Try this rolls out. So I said, all right, cool. It's only a one mil. Two-door rolls in amber. All on me. Another song's gonna be on the CD, all on me. I got a lot of work to do, man, coming up. Lord willing, you know what I mean? I'm trying to get that done. Um, yeah. Again, Tudor Rose and Amber. And this is a special edition, so you're not gonna find this everywhere. You're not gonna find this everywhere. You're not gonna find this everywhere. What's going on out of it? Nemo's is out of it. They ain't had no more. Come with this nice felt. Look at that nice felt, y'all mean, right there, red label. She put a selling joint on the back. 65 bucks for all the one mils, of course. This is special. And what is in this? Rose, warm, spicy, amber, fresh, spicy, and we're going to go patchouli. Try to find this anywhere on eBay? Not going to happen. You're not even going to find this on eBay. You're not going to find air. See, before I go buy something, I make sure you can't get it unless you go to the store and buy retail. You're going to find this retail. Amazon, retail. eBay, retail for this. Same thing for this. You're going to have to pay retail. You're going to sneak this under me. You're going to go cheap it out and buy this from under me. No way. You, ain't nobody on TV. Exclusive. Ain't nobody even reviewed these yet. These are exclusive reviews, baby. Let me tell you about this right here. Now this is, believe it or not, this is a thicker rose because of the patchouli. That's basically what it is. Just load that up a little bit. The spray a little light. The spray a little light in the draws, but it ain't bad. Man. So when I smell this, I'm like, well, what makes this different from all them other roses? What what makes this different from Velvet Rose and Oud um, from their line? The patchouli. Patchouli. There's no Oud in this. There's no Oud. So let's read what we got in this. Let's read what's popping with it. Bars, bars. All right, the pyramid is gonna be, my screen's acting up, rose, amber, cloves, ginger, patchouli, pink pepper, and musk. Now, when I saw the cloves, I'm like, man, this ain't gonna be no freaking Frederick Mall, John. I hope not, I don't like this one mess around. Clothes, Frederick Maud has got me not liking anything with clothes and I don't even want to, if you got clothes, I ain't going to touch it. Mm. 
when you smell this, it smells like rubber. It smells like rubber. Seriously. And that, I think that's because of the cloves and probably the patchouli mix. It gives like a rubbery type smell. But I'm gonna tell you, when this dries down, it dries down to this beautiful rose. And I think this is the Damascus rose. Let's check it out. Pink pepper. No, it's pink pepper, clove, Damascus rose, Damascus rose, right? Regular rose. We're working with here. What is this? Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, okay. Golden amber, musk, and patchouli. White musk, I'm sorry. And ginger. Here we go with the ginger again. Uh, no doubt this fragrance is Christine Nagel. I'm telling you. And what it was is that it was re-released with pomegranate and ore. Birch and black pepper, not bad. There was something else she sprayed on me too that I like from, uh, from Joe Malone. But this right here, people are saying it's pretty good. Uh, they say it kind of smells like pomegranate and ore, but it doesn't. And Stella, Stella McCartney, whoever makes that. Uh, somebody said, you can't go wrong with this one if you like roses. Spicy, sweet, warm rose. Uh, oh, this is Stella McCartney rose and midnight poison kind of scent with cloves in it. Anybody feeling it? Anybody feeling it? Here's the main one I read. This is a potent, thorny, portrait of a lady-esque rose. It suits the name. Uh, even uh, uh, Julia has a gun, Lady Vengeance. If you want a rose, let's see if this for men and women. Did they go unisex with this? Yes, they did. Just like they should have went unisex with this. So what do we have tonight? Get it. You're going to get this in a one mil. That's all they got it. Just one mil. That's all you can get it. One mil. 1.7 mil. One mil, 1.7 mil. What's, what's the difference? You know what I mean? I heard this track in a long time. Boom, bam, rock and roll deep cool. There's my two pickups roses tonight. Check them out. Check them out. Get them. Moderate, moderate lasting. Pretty good. Probably, you know, I'm going to tell you the truth. It's not bouncing off your arm. Yeah, they're going to bounce off. It's going to go close to the skin after two. But this right here, this evening rose, lasts forever. Hope y'all was like, it get powdery. Shout out to the Joe Malone. A uh, young lady, before I went to buy this earlier today, she was like, I said, I wanted her to smell it. I had it on the card, even the rose. She's like, that smell of powdery. There's nothing powdery about Ellen's rose. There's nothing, you got incense in it. That negates all powder. Just the incense in the room alone negates powder. I'm not sure what she was talking about. Like, I told her I was going to get this anyway, so I'm not sure why she was trying to get Like, I'm not going to buy this because I had the other one. I told her I was getting both of them anyway. Ain't no way that's powdery. There's nothing powdery. I got, I got a nose for powder. It's definitely powder. She couldn't deal with. She couldn't deal with. It. She couldn't deal with that. That yeah, you know I mean, that essence in that rum. Can't deal with that. Get it. Set nude. If you got three hundred eighty-five dollars, get it. Two point four. This is again. I'm not sure what this is. She sprayed it out for me. It's a rose from somewhere. Can't remember. You know, something, something. And that's it. I'm out, man. Roger Real Deep Cooling. Chilling. Gonna end this before 30 minutes. Good to see y'all again. It's good to be back, man. I hope y'all again have a good holiday season. And, uh, you know, hope everything goes well with you. I hope the Lord continue to bless you and your family and keep you safe and keep you uh, out of harm's way. And uh, let's keep doing that. And uh, I hope you guys put a prayer for me and I hang in there and that I get over this kind of like gloominess. You know what I mean? You know, it's a little personal thing, but. You know what it is, man. I'm going to keep it pushing, though, and uh, do what I got to do. All right? I'm out. And that's to make sure I keep up with you guys. You know what I mean? Holla at your boy. Roger. Real deep. Push one of these buttons. Seven. Six. Four. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Pat out.